Okay, let's go. We call it the dry tunnel today. And giving you the entire experience of walking here. You can see where the pool, the pool used to get the water here. <clears throat> this is where we were. And here we walk and we're gonna find ourselves back in the city later because not the entire channel has been opened. This is where the water went through, you know, there's a little channel, original. There are so many tunnels over here for the water. It's a big spring. Later on, when Herod is, bring, is coming here, he brought water with aqueducts from Hebron and Bethlehem. It's a cool walk. It's very chilly here. And we're going to go out soon. So going out, you see the tunnel continues, but we cannot walk there. It's not clean and not clear. Here we are at the bottom of the valley. These houses, we saw it from the... And again, all of this is filling, is uh, dirt and everything that is filled up throughout the years. These are all local Arabs who are living here. It's called the, it used to be Jordanians until 67. Interesting situation that we can talk about. We can walk from here to the Pool of Siloam. That's what we're gonna do. So we came from up there, we went down and we came out and walking there's some ruins of the walls over here of the city and houses also um, from different times and uh, again we can see how beautiful day it is. Walking down towards the Pool of Ceylon.